Utah Transit Authority's bus rapid transit project is about halfway through, but recent budget projections show it's already millions of dollars over budget. 11 News reporter's Rachel Griffin tells us why we are just now finding out about this. Well, word on the budget projections came into the spotlight when Commissioner Bill Lee posted on Facebook that the project will need $11 million more than planned. Commissioner Lee says he met with UTA to talk details on the project. That's when he found out about the $11 million extra it needed. UTA Capital Development Director Steve Myers says the meeting was only the start of the budget discussion. My discussions with Commissioner Lee were some of the initial discussions to brief people about what was coming up at our next meeting. That meeting is scheduled for this month. UTA board member and North Ogden Mayor Brent Taylor says Commissioner Lee's post was his first time hearing about the issue. He says the latest financial records didn't include anything to suggest it was over budget. What is going on with this project that we have used all $14 million of the contingency and need $11 million more. To be clear, UTA hasn't spent all of that money yet. It's just an estimate of how much they'll need to finish the project. Myers says the budget was set back in 2013 and since then prices have gone up. So we've had inflation since then and uh, increases in property values. We're the, we're the victim of a good economy. Myers says other local construction like University Place in Orem has made purchasing land more expensive. Mayor Taylor says he wants to look for ways to cut back costs. UTA says it's worth it to spend more now because it's an investment for the future. And our commitment is to do it right, to do a high quality project. The UTA board will meet on the 12th of October to discuss the budget. That's when they'll find out exactly where the money is going and if they can cut back on costs. Thanks, Rachel.